All right, you ready, right? It sounds like it's a strong trade rumor going around. Not saying that it's legit, concrete, or anything like that. But the Cleveland Cavaliers could trade Isaiah Thomas once again uh, as a part to get uh, DeAndre Jordan. This just came across my uh, Facebook feed. Shout out to Sports Global, Sports Global Elite Facebook group page. My man, so I forget his name. He do an excellent job running it. And I'm uh, not saying it's concrete, but I, I did some research, and there are some articles and some tractions. To some traction to this being true, this your boy CJ Goodfellow back with the Boxing Clinic and more. As you know, we do more than boxing. And, um, you know, in this trade scenario is, uh, you know, as you can read, is, uh, Isaiah Thomas and Tristan Thompson in the 2018 Nets pick um, going to Cleveland to get DeAndre Jordan and, and Lou Williams. Now, one thing I can say is, uh, you know, the way Austin Rivers is playing, he had a bad night. I mean, um... Could him and Isaiah Thomas play together? Yeah. Austin Rivers is a bigger guard. But both, it would be interesting to see how that worked. It, it would be. Um, as far as the deal for the Clippers, is this a good deal? I mean, Tristan Thompson, absolutely not. Moving them any closer to the Kardashians is worse. I, I would just, uh, I couldn't take on that Tristan Thompson contract. I think I got like two or three years left. Now, if it was a year, the last year of it, yeah, this guy's making all this money only averaging five points and five rebounds. Hey, they're going to have to do better than giving me Tristan Thompson. I'll tell you that right now. Isaiah Thomas coming off a hip injury. I think this is a dummy move. Not knowing what Isaiah Thomas' health is at. And mentally, him getting traded again. He mentally was breaking down on TV crying about getting traded from the Celtics. He get traded from a championship caliber team that's going to win the East and the Cavaliers to the L.A. Clippers. I ain't talking about the Clippers that been with Blake Griffin and Chris Paul. These is the classic losing L.A. Clippers. At least he would be with... Uh, at least he would be with, excuse me, would be with uh, with, with Blake, with Blake Griffin. But he, as injured as he is, he might have a mental make, breakdown. He might be on suicide watch, to be honest. And um, I don't know. You know, I don't know about that, you know, about him mentally. But the trade is, I think this is a great trade if Cleveland could pull this off. And also, you taking on Tristan Thompson contract, you getting that 2018 next pick, that might very well be the number one, number two, three type pick. You get Marvin Bagley, so it ain't the worst deal, man. It's just like you got sorry Tristan Thompson, who who's been hypnotized and seduced by the Kardashian sister, who's a total idiot, who got hand me down at the hand me down at the hand me down. I mean, I mean, why would you want a plastic fake chick like that? But that's another topic for another day. Uh, Cleveland would de definitely be the the winner of this trade right now, um, you know. But DeAndre, I mean, and Lou Williams, I mean. Uh, Lou Williams is a good fit coming off the bench, but he ain't no starting point guard. If you want him to be a starting point guard with LeBron, no. He's a guy that needs the ball in his hands to create, similar to Isaiah Thomas. Um, he's a little bit better defender, I guess, because of his size. He could spot up, too. This, to me, wouldn't put the Cavs over the, the hump. DeAndre Jordan would be a good play versus the, uh, the, the, versus the Golden State Warriors. Um, and moving Kevin to the four. And then he's a guy who don't need the ball in his hand. So you get rid of a ball dominant guy starring Isaiah Thomas and moving in a guy like DeAndre Jordan. Um, you know, I think it'll make I think it would make the Cavaliers more appealing to beating the Golden State Warriors, putting DeAndre Jordan there. Him and LeBron would be nasty together. Cause he don't need nobody, to, he don't need the ball to create. And I think that would be a good swap, him and Isaiah Thomas. And getting rid of Twiston Thompson. This 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 right now this trade would heavily favor the Cleveland Cavaliers. It's hypothetical. Um you know, Lou Williams can contribute off the bench, give you some more scoring off the bench. He ain't no old guy. He came out of high school out of Atlanta, Georgia. So he got some juice left in them legs, you feel me? And, um, you know, DeAndre Jordan, he 30, but he ain't that old as well. You know, he went to Texas A&M. Um, so, you know, the Clippers would possibly be getting to start Isaiah Thomas, a ticket seller. You put him with, with Blake Griffin. But you got you to gotta get some more defenders around there. You know, well, Austin Rivers, he's an okay defender. You got to get better on your wings. You got to get you a rim defending big guy that can be a defender. You know, they ain't going to be nothing anyway, you know, in the near future. You know, so, you know, it'll work. You know, this is a trade that can work. Then you got the 2018 pick and get Marvin Bagley or, or the kid from Oklahoma, Trey, whatever, Trey Young, whatever his name is. Or you can deal it and get some more pieces. So, this works. You know, this ain't a horrible trade, but it works. It works for both sides, in my opinion. It makes Cleveland a better championship contender because you can plug in DeAndre Jordan. He could fit in right now. 
he can be your defender, your rebounder. You know, he can handle the bullies on the block and defend the rim. Um, and Lou Williams can give you that that spark plug off the bench. And you're getting rid of a ball-dominant guy in Isaiah Thomas. And Lou Williams can assume those positions coming off the bench and spot up with LeBron as well. Um, I think it's a good trade uh, for the future for the Clippers and for the now for the Cleveland Cavaliers, in my opinion. Let me know what y'all think about this hypothetical trade. TBC, we gone.